What's up, tubes? As you can tell, it was raining outside. And I have a handyman job to go do, so I'm just kind of dinking around, getting my stuff together, just kind of playing the wait and see game to see if this rain stops. I'm just kind of getting my stuff together here. Then I got my drill bag. I'm kind of trying to figure out a different system here. Because my drill bag takes up, well, it did take up three different bags. I had a bunch of these soft sided bags. I had one for my char chargers and stuff. Because, like a dummy, I couldn't buy all of the same drill. So everyone's, everything's got its own fucking charger. And plus, you got you know, your, like your little hand drill, which takes a completely different battery. And the other Makita drills that are of the same model. Then I have a Dewalt drill in here too. Just because I'm kind of a nut job like that and I like to have a drill for every different kind of bit. <laughs> it just drives me nuts. Usually more when I'm dealing with cabinetry. I'll have like a bunch of different bits set up. Today I probably won't use more than one or two. Like like this small one I could probably leave at home. I don't really have nothing light duty to do. And then I had another little soft sided bag. I had my hole saws. And whatever these I call them hole saws too, but I don't think that's what they're called. And then my auger bits. I'm just kind of trying to figure out a new way of going about this. I'm not carrying so many d damn bags to a job site here. You know, when I didn't really go out of the shop much, I didn't care. But I got all these different boxes that help fill up this bag. Then if I got something really heavy duty going on, I have a corded drill that I throw in this bag too sometimes. So I need to I need I need to figure out a better way. Is what I'm trying to say here. So I'm gonna see what I can do. I bought this I bought this big husky box. I'm kind of hoping maybe I can put all my chargers. underneath here plus my extra batteries and plus my hole saws down here and a lot of that extra shit that I don't use a whole lot can go up in here that I may keep just one of these small boxes just for the, the shit I use all the time I'm thinking but if I can get everything in there I don't need that box, that box. So I'll need this one to carry whatever drills I decide to take for the day. Alright, tubes. I got my new box all loaded up. And it was pretty much excess sex. I got everything down to this big box. And then a soft sided bag to carry my drills. And I was from about a glue in there because it fits good in that bag. <laughs> Uh, these are these are my three main bits I use all the time. I've got a number two, a star bit, and a square drive. Or a Robinson bit if you want to be technical. And over here I got my three sixteen bits, which I use all the time. Extra magnetic bits. I got my counter sink bits that I use all the time. A lot of this stuff I don't really use a whole lot. I got it in here. Same with these, I just have these to reach in the long spaces. I don't even really use these all that much. And I got the arbor to the hole saws, which I have another hole saw, a bigger one. It needs to come in here yet, too. My brother's borrowing. And over here's just random drill bits. I got my sockets back there, my small drill bits. 
and my five millimeter bit, which I use all the time for drilling shelf holes or whatever. And I got my step drills. I finally remember what the hell those are called. I got this cheap, cheap uh, countersink. I don't use it a whole lot. I use these more, but once in a while you have a hole that you just need to kind of ream it out a little bit. That's what I use. I need to get something better. And I have these, which I completely forgot about. You put these on a they're depth gauges, basically, for your drill bit. Generally, I just wrap masking tape around a bit. But I figure I had them, I'll throw them in here. Maybe if they're somewhere easy to access, I'll actually use them for once. Let's look in the bottom here. I got my three chargers all in here nicely. And these, these batteries are charged and ready to go. I got my hole saws in here. I do have a four inch hole saw that needs to come in this box yet, which I, I should definitely have plenty of room for that. And I have uh, this Irwin set of drills. I really should just take these bits out of here, but I kind of like knowing <laughs> Having easy access to what the size is when I but right now it fits with this box in here. Plus, I still have to have this box, which has all my extra bits in it. Which what I probably should do. I really only use a couple of these sizes. I use number twos all the time. I use square bits, and I think there's some star bits in here too. Which a lot of the times the star bits I get from boxes of screws I buy. So you, usually when you buy a box of screws you get a new bit in there all the time anyways. Uh, a lot of these, I mean like shit like this where this, double -ended, this, this, this stuff just came with drills. I don't even know why I keep it because I don't, I don't even really use it. I have a bunch of flat tips I've never even used because I don't like using a flat tip. So I do have some room for a screw in here. I just need to decide what I'm going to do about that. But this does fit in there too. So I'm fairly happy to get some of my shit down. And I have two empty spots to put more junk in. So I got my drill set up down to two bags now, which. If I could ever get it down to one bag, or even into this box, that would be great, but it all depends on what I'm doing, you know. And sometimes I just like to take all my drills just, just to have them if I need them. It's like when you're doing light work, like this little 12 volt, that's all you really need. And then I got one of these. This came as a set, of course. Volt. Now I have a love-hate relationship with this drill. I mean, it works good for a lot of things, and there's a lot of things I do not like it for. But I usually take it just because I'm like that. <laughs> but yeah, looks like the rain's kind of letting up a bit. Man. Stop screwing around here and actually go make some money for today. I'll talk to you guys later.